You know, the most important step in a person's life, other than his or her coming to Jesus Christ, to be, uh, for him to be your personal Lord and Savior, um, is the decision to link yourself with another person in holy marriage. True love in marriage is a lifetime of giving, because for love is the first and foremost act of giving. Matt, when I first met you, I had no idea the impact you are going to make in my life. Honestly, I thought you were some weird guy that called himself Matt with a hat and, ra- <laughs> and randomly followed me and my friends around without us inviting you. <laughs> However, when I got to know you, I found out that you were so much more than that. Through our time together, you have shown me what it really means to love and what it means to truly walk faithfully with the Lord. Only God can take two people he's intended for each other and guide them through the years till they discover one another. Amen. It's not a mistake that both of our plans that weekend when we met got changed so that we would be in the right place at the right time, just like today. In my times of sickness and health problems, you've never left my side and you always make sure I have what I need to make me feel better. Even if that means going to the store at 9 o'clock at night just to get me chocolate. You have supported me on the good days and the not so good days. Not only do you support me, but you also support my family. When my family was in a time of heartache, you not only comforted me, but you comforted my whole family, and that meant the world to me. Our journey has seen a lot of ups and downs from the very beginning. I'll never forget being in the hospital room in Lexington, Kentucky for Mama Lip. Singing her favorite songs. She sang all those years in the church, and just it takes faith in getting through hard times and believing that Jesus Christ died on that cross. And no matter what, we will show a lot of love in a world that doesn't show a lot of love. So, Kaylin, even though I can't love you first, I will always love you second. You will always and forever be in my prayers. We will always lean on the Lord's guidance in our life with decisions. I promise to be by your side. Life is worth it when you're with the one you love. You are my best friend and my soulmate, and I thank God every day for putting you in my life. So as we start our life together, these are the things that I promise you. I promise to love you unconditionally as He has first loved us. I promise to always seek the Lord first and you second, and to put Him above all else. I promise to encourage, support, and believe in you. I promise to listen with an open mind and an open heart. I promise that no matter what gets thrown our way, we will work together as a team to get through it. I promise to laugh with you in times of joy and comfort you in times of sorrow. When you're sick, I promise to spoil you as much as you spoil me. I strongly believe we will be better together than apart. I will not run away when life gets tough. I will show unconditional love in those times. I will do whatever it takes to provide for a home and our future kids. I promise to always comfort you when anxious times come. I will always love you like Christ loves his children. And I promise to never forget that this is a once in a lifetime love and to always know in the deepest part of my soul that no matter what challenges may carry us apart, we will always find our way back to each other. Matt, I ask you, do you take Kaylin to be your partner in life, to walk by her side forever, to love and to help and encourage her in all that she does? to take time to talk with her, to share her laughter and her tears as her partner, her lover, and her best friend with everything that you are and everything that you have. Do you promise these things? I do. Kaylin, do you promise these things? I want you to take a good look at him. Are you sure? (laughs) I do. Good for you, Matt. Good for you. You have exchanged your vows and your rings and believing the commitments you both have made it is my privilege as your pastor and your friend to pronounce you husband and wife. Matt, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> it's my honor and privilege to present to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Matt Wheely. Let's 
songs we know Oh well, we blew the speakers Can't stop looking over Just want to hurry closer This is what it's like to feel alive 